Sam Gill. Um, I think everyone would agree when you're seeing someone that is known as a, uh, a an athlete come into a movie, you're like, I don't, can they pull this off? And I think you, you were sensational. <laughs> Shocked you? Yeah, it's, it's very hard work for sure. All, like all the characters, and when I saw them come to life on the screen, I thought to myself as I was watching the movie, I'm gonna fuck this up. I'm gonna ruin it. I'm gonna ruin the movie. I'm no actor. But you know, what I do know, looking at that with the crowd, I have a lot more to give. I feel I have a lot more. So I'm excited about it. Let's see. Well, hope you all enjoyed the movie. Jay, thank you so much. Post Doug Ryman. I want to say how Doug Ryman is not on the stage, he should be on the stage. Doug, without you, what do on, yeah? The videos, the viewers, everything else, like, all the way out, put on a yoke and hold up to it. What was that from there, yeah? When I made the next one, did you get me? Uh, Daniela, did they have movies like this in Portugal? Daniela! Oh my god! Did they have movies like this in Portugal growing up? Sure! I got pain in my body, dog. Not even in real life. I've never seen something like this in Portugal at all. That's why I had to come here to see something like this. How many takes did it take with you pulling the boat up so expertly? Are you a natural boats woman? Uh oh, was that CGI? Have I stumbled into it? Was, it was, it was, uh, no, it wasn't CGI. <laughs> it was me and it was my my marvelous stunt woman, of course. Uh -huh. I admit that they exist. Oh. Well, it's not often you get to play a doctor who's also pro-violence and slaps her father. And, and gets her father she has a lot of issues, daddy issues. She needs therapy like all of us. <laughs> uh, Billy, uh, what a great bad guy. Oh my God, so is Billy. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. You know, guys, see when we were doing this, the scene, and I was saying, your father, you're fucking things up, your father sent me. And I had the golf club, yeah? It was the first shot, and I went at him with the golf club, and that wasn't in the scene at all, and he reacted to it. And I, I was like, this guy is the best actor on the planet. It's not the script, it's not, I just go back and I was like, hell, when we're acting. She relax, we're acting, I feel like the same. That's why you know, yeah, you're amazing, bro. No, yeah, I just like, want to say, like, bro. also, yeah, yeah. My yacht is nicer, and it's bigger, also. That's <laughs> it. I could have been every character in this roadhouse. Yeah. Yeah. I could own the roadhouse. I am the UFC fighter. I have more yachts than Brandt. In fact, plot twist I'm your father. I'm your father. Yeah. Dad? Dad? Thank you. Mom, thank, thank you. Thank you. I have to say, Connor actually showed up. It's wonderful to work with people that are excited like him. <laughs> he really was. He was actually a gentleman the whole time. It was fucking great. To play the villain in this? I don't know, man. You have the hero there. You have Connor. Uh, I'm just floating around in there. How was Did you feel? I was a little bummed because your physique looked great, too. I don't want to leave you yeah, out. Yeah, yeah. You know what? Dana, Dana is the costume lady. Yeah, Dana was the costume lady. Dana, the costumes were amazing. Come on, come on. I want that yo for you. I want that yo for you. With the black jocks. Yeah. I see myself on the, at the Cannes Film it's Festival. It's yeah. right I see myself at the Cannes Film Festival, sideways on the Lambo. You saw me on that thing, yeah. Uh, JD, I had called you. I don't want you to feel left out. No, um, I, I want to listen to Colin. Well, you will. Don't worry. Uh, there's a lot of cool ways to die on film, but getting eaten by an alligator, what an honor. It was an honor, man. You know, Doug got in the water with me, and he wasn't going to let me do it alone. And he just, we, all we kept talking about was the death from the second I got there. I was excited to see how they were going to do it, so uh, the crowd loved it. Yeah. Okay, I'm Jessica. Great look, great dress. So good, so good. So good. How much is a drink at the Roadhouse if you can pay your bouncer twenty grand a month? <laughs> and why didn't they sell Temple Bar? It's twice as good. Oh, I have no idea. 
Yeah. <laughs> I can tell you, I own a roadhouse, yeah? Yeah, yeah you, in Ireland, you can speak to it. In Ireland's Dublin city centre, the prices are extortionate and shame on the Irish government. And the raises in taxes, because the prices are ridiculous. And that's from a bar owner myself. That's what you said. It costs a lot, yeah? It costs a lot, doesn't it? How you doing, Dax? I'm gone. Um, <laughs> I should have expected to get blown off the stage by, by the notorious. No, what's your man? I listen. I own, a, I own a roadhouse. <laughs> I own a roadhouse on the Crumlin Road, Dublin 12. Yeah, like I said earlier, you saw me in the Lambo going sideways. I own a roadhouse in Dublin 12. They come in and leave your head five ways. Yeah, that's Dublin 12, Ireland. I see what I'm exactly. representing. But I will say to you, I'm a of Hollywood. I want to do something very on Hollywood. I feel like I'm tight as 